8.47, giant queues have been forming around the country outside Sainsbury's and not because of the groceries they're selling. Andy's here to tell us the reason. This is yeah. women in handbags, isn't it? No, well, or shopping bags even. This, this is all because ah. of a, a massive rush. Oh, well, are they shopping bags? No, no, well, it says it's not. Yeah, 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 yeah to buy th these reusable shopping bags that Sainsbury's is offering, offering for £4.99. Of course, queues, according to some reports, going on for hundreds of yards or even miles. Now, Sainsbury's is selling the bags at that cheap price because of this campaign they've got to get people not to use normal plastic bags and they've been designed by Anya Highmarsh and they're made of cotton inscribed with the words I'm not a plastic bag desirable not least because some of her bags sell for more than a thousand pounds and celebrities have been seen wearing them we can talk to Anya Highmarsh herself good morning good morning you're at the store in Cromwell Road in West London what are the queues like there uh, well they're still pretty big at the moment but um, it's uh, nice and happy and everyone's having a good time which is lovely what do you make of this frenzy that you've caused well, it's really exciting, actually. It just shows that people do give a damn about making a difference. And um, I think that um, it's very encouraging, really. And I think that we need to uh, really draw on this and, and take it much further. I hate to be cynical, but is it really about making a difference to the environment? Or might it have something to do with the fact that you can sell these bags on eBay for 150 quid? You know what, either way, I don't really care, because actually whoever ends up with it ends up being a sort of unwittingly being a billboard, saying, I'm not a plastic bag. And it's really that 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 uh, influences, so it's a sort of a win-win for the environment in my opinion. And I used to feel a bit upset about eBay and actually I suddenly realised that it all contributes to awareness and the point of this project is about awareness. But if I was able to get hold of one of these bags, I wouldn't be using it for my shopping. I'd, I'd be <laughs> giving it to my wife you. as a present. <laughs> Well, you'd still be using a plastic bag, wouldn't you, you traitor? <laughs> <laughs> and, and, yeah, I know somebody who's, uh, whose mother is being forced to take along uh, the, the girl's father as well because it, the, there's, a, there's a one bag per person rule, isn't there? I know, there is. <laughs> we, unfortunately, just didn't believe or understand um, or realise really the, the uh, demand for these bags. And we had, unfortunately, um, not ordered enough. And, um, in fact, it must be very frustrating. We've had a few frustrated customers calling our office, in fact, quite, quite a few. I mean, um, but we just didn't realise how many we would need. But there's 20,000 of them. Are you going to put some more out? Well, it's a limited edition project. Um, we are actually taking it to the States. We've had so much uh, demand for it sort of worldwide now. We're launching it with Whole Foods in the States in June, and we're launching it across uh, Japan and Singapore and, and sort of Southeast Asia. So it's going to, and those are some of those, and their new colors as well, will be available on our website. Um, so people will have another chance. Um, but it's just taken us by surprise. Annie, hi, Marsh. Thank you very much indeed for that. Sainsbury's shares are up this morning.